Hello everybody and welcome back! Another episode of the Slowmancer. Enjoy! My shovel compass indicates a bridge in this area. We should close it. It's our own way. The shovel compass repair kit anyway. Let's go! Alright, ooh, take that. I think bleeding is not what it used to be. And we like, eh, could be much better. Ooh, new enemy, cool. I like to see that. Oh, there is a special bridge, a different color. Yeah, hit this guy. All right, Ooh. it's circling around. Interesting. Okay, to the, to the left. Definitely more enemies at one spot. Okay, let's head down. Boom, boom, boom. Ooh. Leave me out of your shouting. I don't have time for this. Oh, so many of them. I need to do a full, full circle. The enjoyment of listening. Cracking pots everywhere. Okay. All right. Uh, let's check out what we have. Oh, we have another tier. So what are we? What is it doing? Mm, the mighty sing deals eight additional damage. Additional damage is equal to one percent of your max life. Oh, okay, that's interesting. If the mighty swing is perfect, there's an additional 1%, 1.5% life leech. The mighty swing has additional 11% um, overdrive chance. What is overdrive? Huh. That's, that's interesting. I don't know what, the, what it means. But... Yes, it got it. Might is an additional inner fire chance. What is inner fire? <laughs> All right. Um, maybe I will not go for anything right now. But the increased damage, maybe I should go for that. It's like 800. Ooh, yeah. Slorm Reaper level 2. Fantastic. We need more damage. Experience. Got it. So. Oh, it's... It seems like it's bigger different than it was. No? Am I am I mistaken? I feel like they level up and I'm now uh, giving them more damage. Much more damage. I don't know about that. Oh, I spawned the enemies. Mm, never mind. Right. That one. Ooh, gold-plated sword. What that? What? New slorm reaper found. Gold-plated sword. Let's go for uh, armor. And let's go to the inventory. Okay, good slorm reaper. Huh? Level two. Here it is. What is the difference? 28 to 36. Oh, raw damage and attack speed. Okay, and this one? And they got, like, much less damage. But, thorns damage, you have zero max life. Max life is equal to your thorn damage. Oh... Granted ancestor skills, gold armor. 
You have 1% retaliation and 50% all damage reduction for the next 4 seconds. Okay, that that's interesting. Like, those swords and stuff changing a lot how you play. Because that sword is based on the torn damage. You are going for torn damage, you're using that sword, and it's giving you absolutely different kind of stuff. And that, that's perfect. I like that. I like to see that. But for now, I feel this sword better. Oh, hello. I like to kill all those others first. That's oh. Oh yeah, the the stacking bleed on the uh, elites, really cool. Okay. Okay, we got it. And what is this? Exalted what? It seems like uh, it's normal breach, but you will get benefit. Right? Exalted breaches give you a powerful bonus for a short period of time that can be extended. Make most of it. What is this? Exalted haste, your attack speed is... Oh my god, 75% attack speed, that's crazy. What you want me to do, huh? Nothing, just go with it and slash everybody. Alright, there's another village. This compass is actually helpful. Uh, hello. Thank you for getting me out of the solid place. I was able to steal a few valuable goods before you came. i show you my loo when you be we get back to village. I wanted to make, uh, like, different voices for every character, but I feel like I will forget the voices and I will be super weird. Now I forgot all of them. And, yeah, that's about it. <laughs> so, uh... Yeah. And not really consistent my uh, voice switching between those characters. <laughs> uh, yeah. Uh, hi, handsome. My name is Jemma. Is it Jemma? Yemma? Oh, I don't know. But I buy and sell all kinds of rare objects. You look like you're getting rich. Mm, we should be able to do business. You can take a look at my goods if you want. Alright, hi, oh, pretty hot. I've got some top quality goods. Are you interested? Yes, I'm getting rich, so show me your wares. Fasion elemental resistance, I can use it because I don't have anything else. Uh, attack speed, critical strike chance, nope. Nope, 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 nope. Thorns damage, see? Thorns damage. Evasion and thorns damage. Evasion, raw damage. Okay, go for raw damage. No, thorns damage and armor. Max life and thorn damage. Okay, and raw damage and max life. Hmm, pretty decent. Good, cool, 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 cool. Alright, let's go and hi there, but boy, doing something today. I'm rich, so give me something. 5,000. Alright, and I have 1,300. Alright, you can't see it, it's on the, on the camera, but I have 1,300, and she telling me I'm rich. And the first thing I can buy is 5,000. That's perfect. That's like she's mocking me. Mm-hmm. That's what it is. But that's alright. I will take it. So let's let's go for the guy. Uh, he tell us, uh, told us that we should visit him when we have a first. It's good to see you again. 
I see you found your first Slorm Reaper. Excellent, excellent. I hope you like it. Did you know the Slorm Reaper can be found by destroying Slorm Breaches? Yeah, so if you are looking for new Slorm Reapers, uh, it's best to look where Breaches are appearing in large numbers like Expeditions. Alright, so we can go for the Expeditions and uh, go for more Breaches at once. <laughs> Now we are going for a big quest, so let's go here. I left my shovel compass repair kit here, but I don't remember exactly where I left it. I need few minutes to remember. Careful, monsters are coming. Okay. Oh, wave one. Cool. Oh, green. Three. Ooh. Nice. That's perfect. Slorm Reaper, another level. That means and uh, much more damage. Go for. Oh yes. I feel it. Oh, new level. Let's go for toughness real quick. Next level I will have uh, the max HP and everything. And then we will focus maybe on attack speed. Or maybe we will go more into damage. I don't know. But I feel like have the meal cla melee class and have uh, HP and armor. It's good. It's like... I can do more mistakes by that. Something new. Yeah. Ooh. Okay, 6 out of 12. That's other thing what we will need. It's some uh, regeneration of HP. Now oh, I feel like uh, it should kick in my end. Like any second. Any second. Some healing. Oh, ho, 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 ho. Level 7. Uh, wave 7. Okay. finish this one good 8 out of 12 all right feel like kill the ranged characters as the first thing to do already to evolve what evolve I haven't encountered that before. So that that should be new, new thing. All right. Why not? Or maybe they just move it to like they that could be like thing in the future. Like when you are in end game or something, you can evolve your weapons and now they move it uh to the normal progression. That could also be a thing, but I feel like I am getting smacked a little bit. Last 400 HP. Woo. Last wave. Okay. Okay, level up. That's perfect. You're going to going to laugh. I remember now. I brought my shovel compass repair kit back to the village a few days ago. 
So it's my cup then. Well, uh, so we can get <laughs> my cup. <laughs> uh, yeah. What a questing. Oh my god. Look at the point of the... Of the whole campaign, you will go across the mountains, across the rivers, across everything. And then by end of the campaign, you'll be like, oh! My god, it's in my cabin! I already dig up the relic! <laughs> uh, it's all good. I got my kit back, and I made some repairs on the shovel compass. Now we just have to reach the crypt of Mech Rip to underneath the destroy of indestructible and unbreakable seals. The crypt is located at the far end of the graveyard, and we will need to cross a very dangerous areas to reach it. Let's get going. Okay, one point. We are going for toughness, that means that we have 19 armor plus and 131 max life. Uh, and that's what counts. Now, ready to evolve. Simply select the strong reaper to the right of your trigger to evolution. Uh, what? Adam Nostrus Source is evolving. Adam Nostrus Mighty Sword. Got it. Alright, so uh, how many... Is it like the whole row? No, it's not. Oh, there is a connection. So it's like one, two, three. This one is alone, right? Alone. Alone, alone. And this one is one, two, three. One, two. One, two, three. What the hell? I don't understand. But we will find out. But we have evolved weapon. What is the difference? Can I... Oh, yes. Like this. 56. Okay. Okay. Raw damage attack speed. Whenever you open a breach, you gain Adam's Blessing, granting you 20% attack speed for the next 5 seconds. Adam Blessing lasts 1 second longer for every enemy inside the breach. Huh. Interesting. Okay, I take it. So, let's go back. Uh, the shovel combat is going high wire. There must be breach nearby. You should destroy it. All right. Oh, is the mm, I think I have level ten. Choosing a specialization. Yeah, that's what is it. Okay, level ten specialization. Uh, so uh, distinguished knight, hub as a champion or enduring protector. Ha. Huh. So strength, polyvalence, crowd control, totems, key mechanics, skewer. Oh, that's the thing they were talking about. Uh, whenever you skewer an enemy, 10% of damage will be dealt again every time you deal damage to a skewed enemy. An enemy can be skewed up to 5 times. Okay. And support is what? Through the balanced training, the might uh, knight gets the best of the weapon. He lands the official and deal damage and to control the battlefield with his banner of war. Okay, this one. Luck, trigger effectiveness, area of effect. Oh, those are the fortunate things. Ah, key mechanics. So retribution, whenever you trigger through retribution and block. Whenever you deal damage, you have chance to block equal to the number of block stacks you have. And support. The mighty knight doesn't know what he is doing. Right, soul and luck and astral help. It's effective. <laughs> okay. Uh, this one is uh, jump high in the sky and land on target location. Okay, and the other one was what? What the totem? You plan down a random ban of war. Okay, ban of pro uh, provocation towns nearby enemies, ban of regeneration health, haste, attack speed, and slow enemy. Um, okay, and the last one defense, torrents, and tenacity. Block. Unlock support. Enduring protector. You have an impenetrable shield around you, then the last 3 seconds and for melee and projectile damage whenever you notify damage and deflect you can cast counter technique. Oh okay. So we have three specific Oh my god! All of them sounds good. I like it. 
the banner, the jump, the uh, protect, uh, deflect, and they get the mechanics. I don't think I like the the circling between two, uh, 25, 50, 75, uh, 100, and it's really special, and then let's go again. I think I will go for this one or this one. This guy will uh, go for armor, toughness, uh, yes, armor, life regeneration, okay, and deflect, alright. And this one is going for damage, I would say, armor, if you cast fortunate, it applies skewed every name in a hit, you deal 6% damage on skewed enemies. So, I will go uh, for the Red Knight, crowd control totems. Yeah, I would say I will go for this one. Become the Distinguished Knight. Can I go for... Yes. I can change between those. Alright, alright. But you have to level them up uh, again, right? Yes, level 1 out of 12, and you can go for all of them. Ha, huh, interesting. Let's start with this one, and if I will not feel like the, the, the character, I will switch. Why not? So, banner. So, how do I choose what the banner it is? It's random? And how long is the duration? Is it still working? No, it have to be the circle there, and this is that, that's a healing one. Okay, so it's it's random. But how much uh, mana? Oh, let me see uh, the items. Mm, attack speed, vision. I want. Oh, vision max life. Mental resistance, I will take it. Movement speed, armor. I'll go for movement speed, why not? I even know critical strike chance, let's go with that. Rather. Attack speed, armor, no. Raw damage, attack speed. Okay, that's more damage. Mm -hmm. Movement speed, no. Movement speed, no. I know, alright. And that's all for this episode of the Slow Mancer. Hope you enjoyed that and I will see you tomorrow. Until then, stay safe and as always, be kind, keep the smile and don't forget to comment, like and subscribe. Peace guys and see you tomorrow. Bye.